Israelite who, who needed to be need to get to work on time, that nigga would have bolted. And he would have left that chick standing there, man. He would have. He would have left him standing there. And, and then when Jake get written up, oh man, I, I thought you would be happy. You should have you should have followed me, man. I was there. That's crazy. They probably they probably pirates. Probably are. <laughs> they're going over that bottle of water. Yeah. Yeah. They probably are. He's probably freaking off on it. Yeah, he probably yeah. are. Who, who knows? Our people are wicked, man. They're mm -hmm. wicked. Yeah. That was crazy. That was crazy. You got that? Yeah. What do you expect, though? That's me. This is Jeremiah 2 8 33. What should this bell die waiting to see blow? Y'all Christians? Let's talk about the Bible. Y'all Christians, right? Uh, agnostic atheists. Satanists. One of them. <laughs> <laughs> you mess with Satan's son. You got knocked out. <laughs> oh, yeah, you saw that. Craig, you got knocked out. Oh, hey, you know the devil. It's all about they ain't nothing. Now, his wife walking by, black guys. Black guys. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Yeah, smiling and all smiling that. and shit. But he probably freaking right along with her. They probably thinking the same thing. They have freaks. I mean, he might some freaks. Yeah, like got little cams and shit for that person. It's Jeremiah two and thirty three. Why trimmest thou thy way to seek love? With therefore hast thou also taught. A wicked ones by ways, right, right. And uh, what's that? Uh, this who who self pity a charmer when he is bit? Yeah, you know that's that's where he that's where he, that's where he is, man. He saw a snake. Okay, that's a serpent. Oh, I wouldn't say it's Psalm fifty eight. Hey, can you get Psalm fifty eight? I'm looking up. That's not the We're going to talk about never trust thy enemy. Okay. Um, that's Ezra's 12th chapter. I believe it's Ezra's 12th chapter about the 10th verse. When it says never trust thy enemy, you can get that real quick. Second Ezra. Second Ezra. Second Ezra 12 and 10. I believe it's there. I got, I got this quick one. This is uh, Ecclesiastes. No, oh, it's, yeah, second, it's Ecclesiastes 12 and uh, 10. It's, it's Ecclesiastes Sarah. Yeah, and then further down, it's 13. But yeah, you can start at 10. Okay. God damn. That was something. It's always something new. Yep. Now that's why we say they love saving these songs. Yeah, man. That's why we say the body again. The water you have by the side will put you two thirds to death. Man. The Lord gave me that job, first okay. off. Right. There's no such thing. That's a video. There's no such thing as a black community, man. Right. Uh, that's funny. We were just talking about that. Yeah. You know, and that and that has no so much love for the black community. This is a little girl with a face shield on. A plastic face shield right there. Yeah. Hey man, America's a circus. This is uh, you in the open air and got a, a full face mask on, man. So he was up there. What? He was up there at the store the other day. Yeah. This guy had a face mask with the scene on the face mask. I'm like, God, they just running this store, running out. But that ain't the mask. It's gonna be like a big ass man. And a face shield on, like that. But everything else is open. Yep. The sheep will follow. Hey, you fucking 400 pounds with a big ass mask on. Can't even breathe. You can't even breathe just regular air. Right. Not alone with a mask on. Right. Very true. Got a big ass old man walking and shit. You can't even breathe. That yeah, fucking 200 pounds, 300 pounds off the weight. <laughs> They got a full face mask on and shit, man. You know? This is Ecclesiastes 12 and 10. 
never trust our enemy. Yeah. That God, you know, wasn't going to trust him like he, like he can actually get this word. It's only for Israel. I mean, actually, at the end of the day, it, was still a, it, it ain't hurt us. Because it was the devil anyway. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But we wanted to tell him his fake and, and show him, according to Christian Wood, uh, what's that? Um, surely your father's Jeremiah 16. Surely your father's inherited lies. Mm -hmm. You know, your father's inherited. That was our people, but that's them too. And he knew more than that nigga. Did didn't he? He knew more than that nigga. He that knew that probably. the Lord was an Israelite, and that he didn't look like that. Oh. That that Edomite. That's what set the nigga off. Yeah, yeah. He wanted he wanted he wanted Jesus to be white. <laughs> How many people believe yeah. Jesus is white? Do you believe, young man? Hey, yeah, oh, you really believe? He said, "Yeah, dude." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <shit>. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you can tell the little boys this is a this is a Christian oh, pastor. Yeah. Do you believe? Do you believe? <laughs> He's like, "Yeah, I believe." Yeah, I believe. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. Uh, it says, <laughs> "It says never trust that enemy." But like as iron rusted, so is his wickedness. And you niggas are more of an enemy than, than Esau right now, man. Right here. Well, see, when you look at niggas, you can see that in. You just look at it. You can, you can feel the, 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 the griminess just oozing off that. Just off. You, say, mm -hmm. you can even be behind him, you can still feel that shit. We talk about get off the street, so, so what? I don't, I don't mean nothing. You, got, you don't have five minutes. That goes to show you they value what Esau gives them more than what the Lord can provide. Yeah, they value that they value their masters. Yep. You got it. Right. You want yeah. Says though he humble himself and go crouching, yet take good heed and beware of him, and thou shalt be unto him as if thou hast like a looking glass, and thou shalt know. That his rust have not been altogether right the way. Yeah. A lot of these um Christians, right, even my Christians be trying to make it seem like they uh they they love everybody. But when you go deeper into it, you know, through their ideology, you see that they actually hate people, man. And ultimately, they actually hate the Lord. You know, when you really go into it. Go ahead. Say him not by thee. Lest when he has overthrown you, he stand up in thy place. Neither let him sit at thy right hand, lest he seek to take thy seat. And thou at the last, uh, and thou at the last remember my words. And that's even on the um on the job, you know, being friends with an Edomite on job. You may be cool with them, you know, to keep your job on. You know, but don't be all cool with an Edomite on your job, man. You know, because they'll be quick to write you up. Mm -hmm. All type of shit. Go ahead. They are snake people. But, but, but a nigga, you put some food into the refrigerator, a nigga will eat that shit, man. Oh, you find that shit gone. That shit will be gone. Yeah, right. I seen that shit a couple times up at the job, man. People mm. be like, damn, man, somebody ate my food. Mm. Like, how you just going to somebody's food that ain't even yours? A nigga don't have no mindset of doing any, anything right, man. It could have been poison. Yeah, it could have been poison. Just like you better than it. Yeah. You got it out. Drunk. It says, and, the, and thou at the last remember my words, and be quick therewith. Who will pity a charmer that is bitten with a serpent? Yeah, because the same way he tried to get him to go to uh, work, right? If things was turn, turned around, then he might ain't going to care about you going back to work. You know, he probably like, where, whatever the hell this little shit mo is, where a little shit mo at, man? See, a, a charmer is one that feels he has total control over something that he's not supposed to. Right. So when he gets bit, everybody like, well, that's what the hell you get? Yeah. So when this white man rain hell on that dumb nigga, and they go back both late. And, he, and, he, and the nigga gets fired, and he still got his job. Who gonna pity him? You know, that's a good point. You know, what more do you say after that? You know? <laughs> Who gonna pity you, man? Hey, hey, 
even if I was uh if I was a boss, right? I hire Edomites more than, than I hire some fucking niggas. Right. 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 And I would believe that I would believe that Edomite more than I believe that nigga. Right. right. Yeah. They right. surpass the team to the week. Right. Yeah. You know? <laughs> you go to a boss, the boss gonna look at the Edomite more and trust their word more than you. Yeah. Dumbass nigga. Hey, I, I up, uh, you hear me outside? Yeah, come. Uh, I'm going to watch it. See, everybody will listen to that. He's <laughs> down here all the time. Then it says, for any such as come nine twelve feet. Yeah. Uh, uh, a lot of uh, our women be turning on our men, putting them on child support, man. And the father could want to be in the child's life, man. Just straight try to shit on the guy. For no reason. And then we tell you, hey, you stupid for messing with these dumb ass bitches. You know? And it's the truth. Everybody got a problem when we sit up here and say that certain things is wrong, that the man should be doing his, his job. But when, as soon as we say that women ain't doing what they supposed to do, it's a problem. Yep. Yeah, That's they right. Got, they got backlash. I don't know what it is because, because women aren't used to real men stepping up and telling them what it is, what, what, what they're doing wrong. So they, you know what they do? They fan their hand and they, you know, they talk, start talking shit. They're queens. They say, hey, let them be queens. They don't even know where their world queen came from. That's why the heavenly father, that's why the Jake's getting shot down and down in the street, left and right. You know, these these women, these women are, are nothing but whore and uh and prostitute. That's all it is now. Uh the men are a bunch of thugs and, and gangbangers and low life, and the women are a bunch of whores and sluts. That's and why they went that's why on your card you have something, anybody play cards or something out of cards. What the fuck is that, man? Like, yeah. that, that's the type of shit you talk talking about. Yeah, that's just... That's some nasty, bring me ass shit. Yeah. And I got, I'm guessing that's her husband. Yeah. When you look at the cards, right, you have something called the Queen of Hearts. See? Yeah. Bitch, the Queen of... Queen of... Uh, and it's... The Queen of Hearts is uh, taking Jake Hearts, man. Yeah. Yeah. Your spirit. The sucky bus. The, yeah, the Queen of your spirit. Yeah. Yeah. These women ain't right. And like the Akiyam said, like the brother said, you know, we, 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 we sit up here and warn y'all. There's so many videos out now. It's it's, it's almost to the excuse. It's a, ain't a, it ain't no excuse, you know. These are left, left and right. These, it's almost funny now because these, these men should know better. You know, these women divorcing these guys left and right, taking half. It's not it's not about love. And if these women out these these women don't love you no more. Nah, it's all business, you know? They don't love you now. Yeah. That means Jake's, because their esteem is so low as well, they need an extension of women to make them feel better about themselves yeah. by letting their women come out in lingerie and shit. Yeah. Well, how that, would you let your wife come out in lingerie while you're going out? They're used to the, to the women ruling over them, you know? I got a bad woman. Look at her. And then you're just showing it off the rest of the woman. And it, I mean, the rest of the men, and she's just going to sleep with other men. Hypergamy. Yeah. You know? they, they, uh, it's called monkey brand. You know? Yeah. So they're swinging. It's, it's, yeah. It's a culture. Uh, it's a culture. And Esau loves it. Them so called two, so called two women. They wish they were They wish they were us. They love the foul of us. Hey, they take it. Here it is. We're telling you your nationality. And you, you, you pulling the, the wicked away just to go back to, to, to master, to your job, you know? You see that, that, so that Edomite ain't worried about no damn job. Because he know he can get that late and, you know, hey, he like to get a job quick. Yeah. <laughs> they don't need to be working at National right? It's you niggas that's holding up America. It's you niggas that's holding up America. Because yeah. the, these elites, they're going to they they crash America. It's you niggas that love America. You can bring it out. Yeah, if, if they wanted to see, it was about the truth. When you brought the truth out and you said something about Jesus, he looked, his eyes start blinking. That demon. Yeah. So if he was behind the board, I mean, behind the building, they was doing some freak stuff, he wouldn't be worried about being late. 
It was only because of the truth. The hell is that smell? Right. That, that truck, the truck rolled by. God, America is just a, a big duck. Cesspool. Yeah. Cesspool. It, 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 boy. It's, it's the smell in America. It's, it's garbage everywhere you look. This is supposed to be. I, I, you know the foreigners. They uh, do you remember that myth that they said it's America's paved with gold and all right, that? Right, right. You know, it's just one big duck. You know, and it's people just, love it here. Our people love it here. Yeah. This this place ain't ain't shit, man. Right. It's 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 you niggas.